Okay, Sisters fans, now a very, very interesting question came up. You know, I still stand by what I said about the episode. I really didn't like it all that much. It was funny in places, but in terms of an episode, it really didn't do too much to move the storyline forward. But during the bickering, yeah, the 10-minute bickering between Fatima and Karen, there was the hilarious scene, or the hilarious moment, when Karen just randomly says, oh, wait, oh, wow, you sleep with your co-workers, ain't that what you do? And then Fatima was like, no, nah, that's Andy. Wait, actually, you know what, yeah, Andy's your friend, but isn't that what you all do? And I made a, um, a meme or something out of that today and posted it online, and I had a picture of Danny and Q, Sabrina and Jacoby, Andy and Robin, basically Karen's friends who have all slept with co-workers couple things with that number one personally i do not count paris because he and his mother have their own like custodial cleaning company or whatever so they are i guess hired slash contracted by the law firm to come clean and stuff so i yeah i i don't count him as a co-worker i i personally don't i mean that's like if you that's like you know i work in i worked in the call center so it's like Let's say I was, um, you know, if I had sex with the, you know, the woman who came to fill up the vending machines or something like that. Am I sleeping with a coworker? I don't think that's the case because we don't work for the same company in terms of, you know, what we do. What, whatever. It's made. I, hey, whatever it is. If you count it by all means, personally, I don't. I don't. Okay, but. In any case, the question is, why would Karen say that, and how would she even know that Fatima has slept with a co-worker? Because, well, um, she did, actually. The one-night stand with Hayden. That's why he's so fixated on her. Or should I say was, before Tamara came into the picture. It was pretty much um, a one-night stand. Hayden's been fixated. Fatima wasn't interested if I remember correctly weren't they like super drunk or something but regardless um how would Karen know about that now the only potential way would be if Andy told her now I mean maybe there was some off-screen gossip but there was the episode where Karen showed up right as Zach was getting arrested for coming in and whooping Hayden's ass and then she wanted Andy to explain everything I don't fully remember if Andy said everything there was to know about how Hayden and Fatima hooked up in the past, I honestly don't remember. I just, the only thing I remember about that scene was when Karen was going around telling everybody, you know, I don't want to have a baby with Aaron because I don't know him well enough. And I'm like, what the hell? But in any case, if it wasn't Andy that mentioned the Hayden scenario, there's only one other possible way that Karen could know that Fatima has slept with a coworker. And a couple people mentioned this to me on Twitter because yesterday I made a tweet about this, about how did Karen know. So, Sister Season 6 takes place after Zatima Season 2. Now, based on the promo for the show's return August 24th, it seems that Zack and Fatima have broken up. During that time, based on the promo that it, that it, uh, that is, there are at least a couple of moments where it's like, wait, are Paul and Fatima about to have sex? And if that's the case, Karen's line confirms that Fatima and Paul did have sex. Now, how would Karen know this? And this is where uh, Twitter really came in handy. A tweet said, well, think of it this way. Fatima tells Angela everything. And based off the trailer, you know, she's there when, like, Fatima slaps Zach, throws the ring and everything. And then she's even on the couch where when she calls up Paul. And if Angela knows everything, she still talks to Belinda. And Belinda, knowing that information, no doubt would tell Karen because Belinda gets her hair done at the salon. There you go. So that could explain why Karen said what she said. And if that's true, then it definitely means that, oh, crap. Fatima and Paul 
hook up a couple of times. But kind of like in the scenario with Paris, I don't really count Paul as a co-worker due to the fact that he works for a construction company, or if I'm not mistaken, he's the owner of the company because he, you know, his dad passed it down to him or something. And, you know, he was, con you know, con uh, on contract to build some new offices at the building that Fatima and Angela work at. So, yeah, there's that. I mean, sure, but Karen could have been talking out of her ass, but, you know, if that's the truth, that pretty much confirms it. Yeah. She had sex with Paul. Angela knows about it. She told Belinda. Belinda told Karen. That's why she tried to throw it in her face. So, with that being said, that's pretty much all I got. So, like and subscribe. Follow me on social media. And I'll talk to you in the next one.